What's up Massive Fam, Zach Kroner here and on today's video, I do CrossFit. Let's do it. That's like, oh my god. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you obviously that's your foot, crazy. that foot there should be down. Flat. Yeah. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely hard to get that shit flat. Wow. Deep breath in. And then come back up. Gently. That's great for your lats. There's a full grip underneath here and pull this up. So it, re it stretches out your lats and it helps with the front right position for the thrusters. Oh, yeah. yeah. Make sure you always have a full grip as well. It's called the prayer. <laughs> and then dig your head down and that will really stretch out your lats. So you need to hold that and sometimes I'll use a stick, hold onto the stick and then really stretch down into it. And bring your head down further in. Catch it. So before, I used to try and use my hands and do that. Yeah. So use all my power to pull it over my shoulder. So even if it rolls, it comes over. So on the almost little front squat, I like to have my legs wide. Some people like to have it narrow. And then you squat down, up, press up. Okay. okay, so don't come up like this and then press up because that makes it harder. Mm. You need to build momentum. Yeah, was, he was saying that you shouldn't feel these fully in your shoulders because I'm used to just pressing. He said you should feel it in your lat and at the start I was like strange but 100% when you're using that momentum, you're using everything and it's a lot more efficient. So that's what I guess we're doing today is it's efficiency. We're doing it for, for reps, for speed. I like to do overhead squats because it helps open up my shoulders because I have to hold it out. Uh, and then it just puts a little bit of weight on my I've never done this. And then you just sit into it. Very hard. 
You're not gonna easily throw up right now. Easily, easily. I'm gonna hold it in though. I need some water ASAP though. I need some water. I'll give you one sec. I feel bad. It's gonna. I feel bad. I'm killing it. It is not hell, you stay massive. So since you guys saw, Zuma just vomited. I'm feeling so dead right now, like this pump is like next level. It feels like I'm just super sitting with legs and upper body, non-stop and no rest. So obviously I'm very unfit, that's what I've realized. But it's a whole nother level of fitness. Like, you get a massive newfound respect for the guys like Obi. Who can do this with like no rest and keep going and going and going. It's just, it is so hard. So we're gonna move ahead, we're gonna keep pushing forward with what we had planned. And at least do like one working set. Uh, because we're gonna cut the workout short. 380 calories in, 46 minutes so far. So we're 46 minutes in, we're gonna cut a little bit short, but I just said, please show me what we gotta do, and I'll try at least one set. Dude, my legs couldn't get him up. Yeah, right? There you go, look, there he is, there he is. He's awake now. He's awake, go. <laughs> and the workout is done. Thank God. That's cross lifting for you. Bodybuilding mix that Obi, that Obi does. And he is actually a Jedi, as his name suggests. So I did hope you guys enjoyed that video. Something a little bit different for the channel. Uh, very different for me. And um, like the video, comment something, anything. And you guys know what to do. Stay a skinny crossfitter. Jeans in my section and slide into your DMs in the PM and the AM. Then I slide into your feelings when you see just what I'm saying.